going on everyone? I finally got my hands on Dr. Squatch Diamond Scrub. Now I was not able to get the deodorant quite yet, but we do have the Diamond Scrub to review. And depending on whether or not I like this, we'll pretty much decide whether I get the deodorant or not in the future. So without further ado, let's look at the cover a little more. As of right now, this is a Walmart exclusive, but I have heard from pretty reliable sources that this will be on the website, on the Dr. Squatch website, which makes sense because I'm sure they wanna maximize sales. So this does have a code inside the box, I believe, for some extra gameplay access. And aside from that, there's not really a larger description of the scent profile because it just says that it smells like a quest for, for survival. Now this is a heavy grip bar featuring diamond powder. I have to say, I really do like the cover art though. Pretty good cover and the bar color itself is really cool. So we'll look at that a little more in a minute. For ingredients, we have saponified oils, naturally derived fragrance, shea butter, diamond powder, pumice, mica, kaolin clay and sea salt. So a lot of exfoliants on there. Let's pop it open and See how it smells. So here's the brick itself. And I really do like the color of this bar. It looks just like the diamond color on Minecraft. And it's a really cool color. Now hopefully it smells good. I really don't know what it's supposed to smell like. I haven't really read a lot of comments about it yet. So this will be my first time kind of finding out. So let's see what it smells like. It doesn't have a super strong scent. It's kind of in the low to medium range. You can definitely detect something. It's not as weak as like the Slytherin bar or the Freedom Fresh. You can smell it, but for me, it's not like in your face, which is okay, I don't mind. Hmm. As far as the sun profile goes, I'll try to describe it as best I can while he tries the bar out. So at first it has a little bit of like a bitter musky kind of scent to it. It reminds me a little bit of the Ravenclaw bar from Dr. Squatch, but then it, I also get like smoky hints almost, almost like not quite as much as dark side scrub, but a little bit. And I'm not like the biggest fan of it right off the bat. It's just kind of a, it's kind of a mixed scent. It's not very clean and straightforward. It's just a very big mixture of different fragrances and it's kind of clouded almost, if that makes sense. It's definitely more of a masculine scent and I don't mind it. It's not like a bad scent. I don't think it smells horrible, but it does kind of just smell like they took a few fragrances from different different, you know, musk bars or, you know, their cologne scented bars, whatever. And they kind of just mix them together. That's what I got from that bar. What do you think? I think it smells like something you'd find underground. I think it smells, oh, well, all right. So you think it smells like something you would mine on Minecraft pretty much. I mean, I guess. Yeah, it does have an earthy scent to it. Maybe that's better than saying smoky. It actually does have kind of a, an earthy scent to it. Hmm. Not quite like a Spartan scrub, but... Maybe somewhere in the middle, I don't know. Honestly, for me, it's not my favorite bar. It's probably gonna be lower on the rankings, but you know what? Well, no, not you know what. I am a little disappointed. I really like the look of this bar and I was hoping that this one would be amazing, but I I'm not the biggest fan of it. So I wish they would have done a better job with this bar and hopefully you guys enjoy it a little more than I did. With that being said, let me know what you think in the comments about this bar and we'll see you next time.